everyone, it's Mr. Flamoose here with a game called Spiral Knights, made by Sega. Now, um, I have not played this game before. I just started, this is like the starting area, and um, I just wanted to show you guys because I figured I was playing, so. I think the game is like single player, um, and then once you get later in the game you do like quests and instances together. So basically it's like a hack and slash sort of um, sort of game. Like I said, it's made by uh, Sega, which really excites me because I loved Sega growing up. Alright. So, basically your UI is pretty simple. I don't know what energy is, but I have a lot of it. That was weird. These blocks sort of explode. You can switch guns by, or switch weapons by using your scroll wheel. Basically, the way you're facing is your uh, controller, not your controller, your uh, mouse. And then, yeah, that's most. What the hell was that? Okay. So. I'm playing this, if this looks kind of crappy, it's probably because I have to play this in a really weird setting, because my video recorder, as always. So, let's just move along, hacking and slashing. You've almost reached the camp. I have the power! Alright, so that was pretty epic. I'm assuming that harder enemies come up later. Alright, so I can go tab. And this shows my shows me my um allow full inspect. Yeah, okay, see I don't really know anything about this, but here's my man. I can turn him around and stuff. You get to customize what he looks like, sort of. Now, um I've been picking up what looks to be these little things, but apparently I haven't been. I think they might be XP oh crowns. Crowns appear to be the money. So, right, let's see. Now the game does look ooh silver coin. Game look does look a little bit clunky on this uh, setting because I'm playing in windowed mode. But full screen, it really looks nice. It's got this sort of you know the soft um, anime e look, and I think Sega does that look very well. You've made it walk into the rescue camp. Okay, so now... Heat, apparently your armor and stuff levels up. So that's pretty cool. Uh, with heat. Um, and here's the loading screen. Do not share your account information. Game Masters will never ask you for your password. Ah, uh, so here's some NP NPCs and another player, it looks like. Um... I can trade, inspect him as, him as a friend. He actually got the same armor color as I did. That's awkward. Um, maybe I can talk to this guy. Uh, tell. Oh no, that's another player. Alright. Welcome to the rescue camp, recruit. This camp serves as both a rest stop for pod hatchlings like yourself. It will develop your skills. Do you have any questions? Your questions? You bet I do. Where can I begin my training? Training guards, just north of here. New equipment, traveling merchant. Uh, Haven, my mission. Haven is a town north of the camp, beyond the great chasm. Spiral Knights have set up a base there. As for your mission, right now, simply get to Haven. Coolio. Um, on second thought, I just think I'll just look around. Alright, so you can move around with WASD, or you can click to move, or hold click to move, I guess. Can't talk to these losers. The fire looks pretty nice, though. Had a chance to try out bombs yet? Unlike any other weapons, bombs can only be used as a charge attack. Doing anything else just causes them to fizzle out. Uh, sounds like a blast. Maybe I'll buy some from the traveling merchant. Alright, so apparently there's bombs. That's cool. Oh, are these, like, treasure chests? No. So it is indeed an MMO. Uh, you don't even really have to download it. 
you just go on their website and it downloads like temp files and then it launches the game from there. So that's pretty good. I don't think it's very, um, very like intensive. I'm collecting geological samples. So far my test hundreds. Um, Alright, he... I don't know. He's he's babbling on about things. Um. Z apparently attacks. Clockworks, massive gears, cool. Uh, gate, entry point to clockwork. Second thought I'm heading out. So Z apparently does the same thing. So who's this big guy? Oh, he's the traveling merchant. Okay, so uh, I have 92 crown. The Beast Basher. Okay, this item will bind to you when equipped. A powerful pick modeled to add an extra helping of hurt to beast family monsters. So it appears like it's got the same attack and lower speed, but does extra damage to beasts. Chop vines. Okay. Proto sword. Ah, same thing. Um, slime slasher kills slimes. Proto gun, punch gun. Use it. Use to blast open drop pods. This emergency rescue tool doubles nicely as the singles. All right. So apparently, good chance of causing moderate stun. Ooh, I would like that. Um, and here are bombs. Okay. An armor. Very nice. But I don't have any money, so... Huh. So that guy is afraid. For his life. I think that's the way out. Guy is sleeping. Alright, let's head up here. Haven. Alright, so let's see. I'm gonna go down here and interact with this. Can I interact with this? Um. Oh, look at this. Explore this derelict portion of clockwork. Um. So this is like the team thing. I think you need five people, but I don't care. I'm just going to do it by myself. Um, levels in real time. You will never see all the levels a world has to offer in a single trip. Only a true adventure. Oh, okay. So clockwork's like... Yeah, for some reason I kind of like flash when I start. It'll go away here in a second. There we go. Um, oh, wait. Do I have teammates? Oh, I do have teammates. Okay, cool. Here's a guy... Let's say hello, shall we? Hello. Oh, I hope he says hi back. Should I steal that? No. Oh, uh, monsters. Open the door. Uh. All right. So this guy said, "Yeah, yeah, yeah." What that means. Uh, oh, treasure! Oh, did he steal all the treasure? I think he did. Oh, what a cool guy. Oh, monsters. I don't like playing with other people. They steal your stuff. Ouch. Alright. I'm so ready for this. Do you guys see how glowing I am? Uh, ah! Nice! So 
So I have absolutely no clue who this guy is, but um, he and I are just owning, apparently. Ah. Alright, I'm starting to get hurt a bit. Are you shitting me? This guy is stealing all my gold. Um... Well, that's annoying. Alright, so I have... I've, I've gotten something. Collecting heat embers will level up your gear when you finish the level. Alright, well this fucker's stealing all mine. Alright, so I can Legend of Zelda this pot. Alright, so here we are. Oh shit. Alright, so this is like the instant sort of stuff going on here. Alright, I think one will heal me. What? Shit. Fucking robot dog. Uh, so those are the heat embers. How do I use this? Um... Oh, I think I already have it on. Alright, I have no clue what's going on, but... Let's just roll with it. Now this guy's getting all the freaking loot again. Oh, I forgot I can block. Found. Thank you, fucker. Come on, I need the money. So there's little puzzle sort of things going on here. Run through there. I know, man. Watch out, dude. Alright, this fucker's trying to steal all my stuff again. Die, you damn robot dog. That's what I'm talking about. Oh shit. Big guy, big guy. That was gay. Ugh. Alright, there we go. Alright, so I think we've beaten the level. Have we? Maybe? Oh no! He just took everything! That's not fair! That guy stole everything I have. Um. Okay. I guess I missed something, because you can apparently just take everything. Um. So that's cool. Um. Now I think that's going to be it for me, guys. I'm going to play this a little bit more. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you think it looked fun, uh, why don't you log on in and uh, 
maybe we can play or something. Um,